Hello guys, welcome to Ask Ragulan. Today we're gonna get into this reveal part two, uh, Satoshi Nakamoto reveal part two. And uh, here he has revealed his identity, so which is there. And um, so let's get to work. To start with, um, spoiler alert. So this guy looks fake. I mean, like everyone believes he's fake. So anyway, so let's get to this. So first thing is um, this blog has been edited so many times. So for the last one to two days, you know, every time when I get here, there is some new changes. So he's fixing spelling mistakes and um, the issues that's been pointed by other uh, Reddit users. He's, he's pretty much he's watching everyone and then he's keep coming and fixing and updating it, which makes it even more, um, you know, like say this guy shouldn't be real. But the real guy wouldn't even matter you know if someone is talking and then saying something you know if i'm the real guy why would i even try to prove it anyway so now uh, again he talks about um uh yes yeah, so he talks about steve jobs and uh, some of those stories and then he talks about uh, the numerology and um and some of these things are just available online so it's like it's not something he found it, you know, some of these things are pretty obvious things, which was um, there. He, he just read through quite a few things and then he wrote it. That's what it looks like. And then um, he talked about his date of birth, email address and how he derived the name and all this kind of stuff. And um, so some of these things have already gone through in the previous chapter, um, previous video. So he talked about all the setbacks and the issues that he faced and uh, how he mined his first um, 980k uh, bitcoins and um, the how he lost it, obvious, just like every other uh, people who are claimed to be Satoshi uh, seems to have a story about how they lost the 980k bitcoins and then um, yeah, he talked about all the screenshots of all the Satoshi's uh, messages and then the, dis the disappearance and then he talks about let's say uh, he, he spoke to a colleague and then he was asking let's say whether uh, he should be coming back and um, reveal himself and things like that so like some of these stories you know I mean like for someone who's who made millions or sorry billions for them to write so much stuff to explain themselves and try to prove himself doesn't make sense okay and then finally he reveals who he is and he says he's a Pakistani I reside in UK I have never resided in US and he graduated yeah yeah Steve Jobs and then my real life identity so that's his real name So that's his photo. So, so people have pointed out several things, guys. The writing style is different, and um, so the way Satoshi has uh, uh, does his some of his white papers as well. If you look at every uh, cryptocurrency, has got this white paper. So that's written by the actual founder. So the white paper that was written for Bitcoin is like say way way more formal and uh, compared to what's up here. So that's one of the things. And then uh, people point out some of the basic mistakes. Let's say if I'm actually a, a developer and uh, if I'm actually working on blockchain, let's say if that is my dream passion and will I, will I say instead of blockchain, will I say brick chain? <laughs> so something like that? No, right? I mean, like this is something, uh, this is something I dream about all the time. This is something my passion. So he, some of the things he says about like uh, cyberpunks, as um, you know, he says like cyberpunks instead of cypherpunks. So this is a sort of like a basic name that a lot of people have taken, like say Hal Fanning uh, has taken this name. So, you know, as people, people have these nicknames around the blockchain for uh, almost like a decade. So um, he made it like a fundamental mistake and um, typos, a lot of typos, spelling mistakes. So, so those things are also there and then he's been fixing the blog as well guys you know like whatever uh, we see on the other blogs people have taken screenshot of the actual blog and then uh, they pointed out issues and that's been fixed so it looks like he's just watching all the news and stuff wherever it's been promoted and anyway so end of the day 
so this guy is fake he doesn't have the 980k uh, bitcoins pretty much he's not a billionaire and uh, he doesn't have those bitcoins he doesn't have the original emails uh, he doesn't even own the domain name um, so pretty much nothing he has in connection with bitcoins so probably the the fork uh, the repositories or what was when was the last time he checked in i mean like a lot of things guys so anyway so um thanks for watching subscribe to the channel if you have any specific things that you want guys i'll do some uh, some more videos um onto career technology a lot of different things we will we'll talk and if you need anything specific just uh, keep us posted thanks guys